All right, guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to um, restore an Android backup, and it's going to be on the Droid Bionic with Clockwork Mod Recovery installed. Um, so you're going to say you're running a custom ROM, which I am right here. This is a carbon ROM. Let me just show it to you really quick, show you what I'm running. And right here, Droid Incredible, Android version 4.2.2, Jelly Bean. And this is a uh, carbon ROM. So, you're running this right here, and you want to know how to restore an Android backup you made in Clockwork Mod Recovery. Maybe before you installed this ROM, get back to it, whatever the case may be. So, what you're going to do is you can go into HBoot and get into recovery, or if your ROM has it, hold power off, go to reboot, and right here it says reboot to recovery. And that will reboot you right into recovery. So, let's do that in this ROM and we should boot up. Otherwise, you get into HBoot by powering off, pulling battery, putting battery back in, holding volume down, and power, which gets you into HBoot mode, and then you would select recovery with power again, and you'd boot into Clockwork My Recovery if you have that installed. Um, obviously, to get to this point, you would have to have an unlocked bootloader, or Clockwork My Recovery installed, the custom ROM, all that good stuff. You would have already seen how to do all those other steps of creating an Android backup and all that kind of good stuff. So we're just going to go ahead and restore. So to restore, it's really, really simple. All you do is you scroll down to where it says restore, backup and restore. And you can actually also scroll with this button down here. So I'm going to use the button to select and then scroll down one. Oh, if I can get it, it's a little touchy. And then restore. And there is the backup I made right there listed at top. It's hard to see, but it just has the date of when you made the backup. Um, this is a backup of stock, uh, basically stock Android system or stock ROM for the Droid Incredible. So we're just going to go ahead and select it. Scroll to where it says yes. Select it. And there you go. It's going to check the MD5 sun to make sure that the backup is a good backup. And then it is going to install your stock ROM, restore it, whatever you want to say. So we're just going to watch it, or not watch it, we're going to let it go. And when it's done, I will show you the finished results and we'll finish up. So just let it sit and go through this. It's probably going to take upwards of 10 minutes to um, restore your Android backup. So just be patient with it. All right, guys, so the restore process has finished up. Um, Everything's good to go on this, so all you got to do is come in here and hit uh, Reboot System Now. And when your device reboots, you will be running um, whatever your Android is that you restored. So whether that's stock, like me, it's going to be stock. If you restored for a ROM, whatever it is, that's what your device is going to running. So just let this boot up to show you I'm running stock again, and that'll be it. Okay, and there you go. We are uh, back to stock. Uh, pretty simple. Now, the reason I don't have any apps in this, just so you guys can see this, is because um, it's all, I didn't actually do anything with this thing. I've just been running full stock with it. So I'd, it would have other custom apps in here. It wouldn't restore it completely to stock like it is here. It's just that I haven't done anything to stock yet, so my backup was made pure stock. Um, so, that being said, that is it. That is how to restore an Android backup on the Droid Incredible. So I hope you guys like this video. As always, please check me out right here at RootJunkie.com right above my thumb. Follow me on Facebook or Twitter right over there. And we'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching.